Now I want to get to uh, a quarterback who had the opportunity this week to be in a starting role for the Oklahoma Sooners. Yes, Caleb Williams took the job of mm. Spencer Rattler. You spoke uh, on that pre last week. Preseason pre um, favorite to win the Heisman Trophy. No longer the favorite to win the Heisman Trophy because his job is gone. All Caleb Williams did this weekend versus TCU, number one, they beat him 52 to 21. Mm. But he, he went 18 for 23, 295 yards, four tubs, four tubs. But not only that, nine carries for 66 yards and a touchdown. And when we talked about this last week, I said, first of all, Lincoln Riley would be crazy as hell if he didn't start him. He would be crazy. Say that. And number two, the, the, one of the things we talked about, how when he came into the Texas game, it opened up the run game for Oklahoma that, that has been non-existent. Well, yeah. let's talk about that run game for Oklahoma against TCU. Caleb Williams is your quarterback. He's a dual threat guy. You got to account for him. Kennedy Brooks had 20 carries, 153 yards, and a touchdown. Mm -hmm. So it, it, it's, it's simple for me. And what I love about this is that I'm glad Lincoln Riley seen it. I'm glad he's seen it and he made the decision. But now when it comes to the committee, they're going to have to judge this Oklahoma football team off of Caleb Williams being their starting quarterback, not Spencer Rattler. So I think that's going to be a positive for Oklahoma on top of a lot of people losing because yes, that's sir. that's helping Oklahoma as well. But that's going to be something that the, the committee looks at and probably it's going to work in their favor because Caleb Williams has get, given them a new life. You would like to think so, I man. Us being former professional athletes and making it to that highest level, we understand the importance and the meaning behind availability is the best ability. Mm -hmm. As an athlete, you can't take a single day off, a single rep off, nothing off because there may be a guy behind you that's just as good as you, if not better than you, and all he's waiting for is the opportunity to get his chance. You mentioned it. Rattler was a Heisman hopeful, one of the top candidates coming into the season. And now he's talking about transferring. And we not even halfway through the season yet. How crazy is that? But it just goes to show you, man, you got to do, do your job, man. You got to yep. do your job. And when you get the opportunity, you got to go out there and execute. Because I had a coach tell me a long time ago, every single day is an interview in this business. Yep. And if that's not the truth, and you, you were spot on last week when you said Lincoln Riley would be bananas to not start Kayla Williams. Now you look like a genius because, <laughs> because there, it's not even a question now who's the leader of that team. Yeah. And you got to give it up to Kayla Williams, uh, the true freshman from Washington, D.C., because if I'm not mistaken, he's the first freshman quarterback to start at OU since 1990. That's 31 years. And Man. I don't know what these young men are doing coming out of high school, but some of them just step foot on campus. They <laughs> ready. Like that's crazy. And I think back to when I came out in 2007, I literally needed two, maybe three years before I was mentally and physically ready. And these young men are coming in. A lot of them are coming in at 17, going to campus early. And it's just a beautiful sight to see, man. But I think sky's the limit for Oklahoma with that young man. Um, unless they face Georgia, but that's a whole, that's a whole different story, but you got to give it up for Oklahoma, man. And I think you really got to give it up for Lincoln Riley because the talent that he's not only developing while he's there, but the success they're having in the NFL, like you got to give it up for him. Like Kyler yeah. Murray right now, in my opinion, is the front runner for the MVP. You know, people could say different things, but when you look at him, when you look at Baker Mayfield, Jalen Hurts, like all of those guys are doing well. And they all have come out, what, in the last three years, if I'm not mistaken? I think three or four. Last three or four years. Yep. Spencer Rattler, I'm sure he'll get a chance. No matter what happens the rest of this yeah. year, he'll get a chance moving forward because of his previous resume. But damn it, this young man, Caleb Williams, we already see what he's about. So if he can keep progressing and improving, man, sky's the limit. And if I was a quarterback, <laughs> on the OU because it's, it's proven they're not only winning Heisman's and going number one but they're having success in the NFL and what else can you ask for support for today's episodes of one-on-ones comes from Manscaped the world leader in men's below the waist grooming Manscaped has just launched their fourth generation trimmer the lawnmower 4.0 
It's a sleek, well-designed and precision, precision engineer trimmer. And I got to tell you, I was blown away by the performance. Listen, fellas, when I was in college, I had a bad experience trying to trim my hairs and I uh, used a razor and actually got cut. So don't be like me, get you a Manscaped and get right. The way that Manscaped engineered the ultimate growing and body trimmer was simple. They focused on intelligent functionality and providing a comfortable grooming experience. The Lawnmower 4.0 is developed with their trademark skin safe technology, which includes a cutting edge ceramic blade that reduces snags and nicks. You need to be confident in any tool you use on your family jewels. The Lawnmower 4.0 has a 4000K LED spotlight, an attachment that allows you to change the length of your trim and a wireless charger. Most importantly, you want to make sure you're not using the same trimmer on your nuts and your face. That's just nasty. So head on over to manscaped.com where you will get 20% off and free shipping with the code one. That's O N E. That's 20% off with free shipping at manscaped.com if you use the code one. As a user of the Lawnmower 4.0, trust me when I say your balls will thank you. <laughs>